I make the decisions. And that is not what many people do. You see, because I see myself in that situation, I drive myself in that situation in a sense to say, these people are trying to take mine for a mug. It's not a request. They're trying to take the piss. They're trying to talk on me, trying to say, trying to, you know, what they're trying to do. And I see what they're trying to do. It's, it's not me having a moment. It's me making an example. Some people out here, they think that they can dictate to you. If somebody tells me, right, to leave, leave them alone and, and get off this, get off site or whatever. I'll sit there and say, it's not a big deal. I'm not going to sit there and view it as an opportunity because it's an owl for me, bro. Me working with an actual man that isn't moving like a little man that's a dickhead and selective in his movements that's like yeah bro we'll spit together we'll work together we'll do we'll we'll shut this down together that's man bro that's man bro you see what these men do in these podcasts and these these videos images thumbnails whatever you want to call them i don't buy it bro i i sit here Never once have I ever done a reaction. I don't need to react to their stupidity. And I'll tell you why. Like I said, the loudest one in the room. Now we could go back to me being around some of these men. Okay, let, let's say me next to a guy wearing a suit. I'm just wearing some casual from home wear. I'm there, sitting there. Not a guy from the hood. Not ghetto. Not gangster. Not saying that I want to be, but because obviously that would imply that I'm lying to myself and I'm a want to be trying to be. I ain't that. I'm for me personally. I'm the best. I'm the bees. Uh, you know, I'm not the bees knees. I'm the be all end all. And that offends man. And you know why it offends man? Because they don't want to be the be all end all. That's why it offends man. 